Hey you guys, so first of all, my mouth is a little bit numb. I was at the dentist this morning. I had to get a crown replaced, so uh, I took the old crown off, did a little bit of drilling. I have a temporary crown on, but I'm, my mouth is still a little bit numb. Um, I'm on Bumble, and I changed my um, profile. I've been, as I'm experimenting with my dating and so on, and sharing my journey with you, Originally, I was on Match.com and Bumble looking for a relationship. I spent two or three months doing that. And then I switched to the Friends with Benefits. And you heard me share about that. There was a second Friends with Benefits situation I had who is more like a friend now. I didn't talk about him. Um, and I don't want to because I consider him a friend. And I don't really like to talk about my friends, honestly, too much. Um and and this that gentleman is a little bit older in his 40s more mature and based on that uh i decided to that i'm on bumble now i'm looking for male friends now i'm sharing that with you because i saw some of my patterns and how i behave differently how i behave um in a less empowered way when I see a man as a potential relationship or as a potential sexual partner. When I approach men as friends, I feel very equal to them. I don't have anything riding on it as to how we get along or how it turns out. Um, if I'm approaching a man, is this just someone I would want for a relationship? Then... Um, I lose a lot of my power. I'm sure many of you can relate. And so I'm like, uh, let me just try this. Let me just meet men as friends. Um, and that means sex is not on the table. A relationship is not on the table. I'm just being in this moment and we're being friends. Um, hey, if there's a girl you like, I'm all for it. Let's talk about it. You know, we're out dancing. You like that girl over there? I'll talk to her for you. Just being friends. No pressure for it to be anything more. That's what feels really good to me right now. And I will keep sharing with you what comes up for me. Also, remember, part of self-care is going regularly to the dentist, getting your cleanings twice a year. Um, if you have any physical ailments or sexually active, go to the doctor, get your regular STD tests, make sure you're healthy, um, eat healthy, exercise. These are all self-care practices. Pay your bills on time, get on auto pay, um, you know, organize your room, clean your home, do your grooming, like basic self-care practices. I'm sure all of you already do that, but in case someone is watching this who doesn't, just a little reminder um, to take care of our bodies and take care of our well-being. And I will keep you guys posted with what else comes up for me. By the way, that's kind of like uh, a friend of mine made, like took a picture of me and made it into that little sketch. It's really nice. This is the bedroom where I... Um, this is my guest room. By the way, if any of you are interested in my Just For Fans page, please send me an email and um, I will, um, with your name, and then I will um, send you the link so you can watch that. I upload hot, sexy x-ray content every day. And thank you for watching my video. Oh, and you guys want to see what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a pretty dress. I should sit like this. <laughs> There, just wearing a dress. I wore this to go to the dentist. Thanks for watching my video.